And why is it that some people develop phobias from some of these things, like clowns as an example, and, and other people don't? Some people just have a more of a predisposition to experiencing anxiety and fear. And so the whole process that you've been talking about this week, those emotional experiences play out in a much stronger way for these people. So you're mm -hmm. going through life kind of with the volume turned up oh. on fear. Mm -hmm. Or maybe you went through a social situation where you felt like you were being really judged or evaluated and you felt really stupid or weird or strange. So what tends to happen there is these, these things get paired up with one another. Mm -hmm. This situation is now associated with fear, and most people cope by avoiding that situation. So we never end up getting a chance to learn new information because we're avoiding these situations. 